Recording live from beautiful Los Angeles, California, ladies and gentlemen, this is No FOMO. We are here today with an incredibly special guest, our friend Henry Fong. What's up, fellas? What's poppin', buddy? Stoked just, to have you on the show. Just drinking a Pacifico with my boys. Just slugging go, some baby. Pacificos with the boys. Absolutely. Can't really beat that, can you? <laughs> Speaking of Pacifico, oh, why do I have the headphones on? Yeah, t- let's, let's go, go dude. Just I'm like to listen to, your, listen to yourself talk. J- Gents, right. what's going on? Um, I mean, for me, I did my usual research for this one because you know I don't know any DJs. Yep. Uh, I don't good. know if you notice I don't listen to EDM music at all. And Probably I noticed good. you don't really have a DJ name. You just kind of went with your own name. So I just wanted to come in, and I came up with a couple for you. If you want to use them maybe just as a song name, or if you want to adopt it, you let me know. Okay? Maybe can, maybe re, like, a re, <laughs> like a rebrand type thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. if you were thinking so about it. So you made me like an alias. Yeah, I made okay. you an alias. Yeah. Uh, the, first so you one I've got here, the first one I've got here I think is the best one. Hooked on Fongnix. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. You're like, ah, that's a good one. I see, what, um, I see what you did there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We went, and then uh, I got another one here. It's Henry... Brings the bing bong fong. <laughs> that's huge. Do you know what my nickname was in college? Everyone called me Fongo Bongo. That's Bongo, fine. That's Bongo. way better than anything I have written down. Yeah, Damn. wow. He just that's dumped on similar. On yours. Yeah. And then I just wanted to throw this one in there. The, the little flex one is uh, Henry Big Dong Fong. <laughs> <laughs> you just want to throw that in? That's my favorite one. We can one use that one. Sure. I'm that, down with that one. That's You'll a go good that one. one. Okay. Okay. Those, that's what they call them in the streets. You know? Those are the streets ones? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I figured the hooked on fong mix could be a good song name at the least. That would be pretty fire. That's my rapper alias, maybe. That's a rapper. There you that's, go. A rapper. That's, a that's my mixtape album for sure. A hundred percent. Speaking of rapper alias, this was one of my questions. If you're a rapper, what would your rapper name be? And it can't be Lil Dreadlock. <laughs> <laughs> you just put a little or a young in front of it, and you're a rapper. Young Fong. Young, young Fong. Fong okay. bro. That's actually pretty. I love good. that. Or like Henry the Eighth or something. Ooh. Ooh. How many Henrys are there? Which is the good one and which was the bad Henry? Because there's the yeah. bad ones and the good ones. I can't keep up. There's should we like, be the, wait, it's a, I think should I be the bad, bad one, right? Though. You want to be a bad one. For you want to sure. be the bad one. Whatever. I think it's like Henry the Thirteenth. Whatever one like pillaged millions of different villages and stuff. <laughs> 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 okay, we got some uh, quick fire interview questions here, just so people can get to know you better. Who is your male DJ crush? And it can't be us. <laughs> My male DJ crush? Yeah. Well, I like, I mean, from a producer's perspective, you kind of, you know, you secretly like people's productions. Maybe somebody like, I don't know, who's fucking fire? <laughs> <laughs> like Joyride or somebody. Joyride. Bro, Joyride he's, the best. he's the best. So this is multifaceted. We'll go one producer nerd okay. out, who's your, and then one, like, a male crush like who's who's the best looking dude dj out there and you're oh, not married easy calvin harris bro there he's, just, yeah. Yeah. he's a fucking goat 100 too yeah he's, bro he, he's just he, the man you seen him his new like full bond look getting ready for funk wave volume two he's looking he's looking spicy the morgue look you mean funk wave volume two he's he's, he's putting that out is that a, that's funk a thing? wave bounces remember that album that he did wait that's what it was called it's literally called Funk Wave Bounces Volume. Oh, one. he's different. And he's putting out the second one yeah. this summer. Are you allowed to call something a volume one before there's a second one? Well, if you know there's a second one. I guess that's fair, yeah. It's kind of okay. like uh, alluding that there's going to for sure. Yeah, he posted them on his like Instagram story, and I was like, he's gonna, it's going to be 10 summer absolute anthems. The guy doesn't miss. All right, let's see here. What else you got, Morgie? Um, um, what is the worst thing you've ever said on the mic at a show? Or the dumbest <laughs> thing? <laughs> Biggest whiff it ever happened. <laughs> Run through the whole catalog. Just like when you forget where you are and you say the wrong city. Yeah, that one. That, that one hits. You know, you'd be yeah. like, you'd be in like Ohio, and you say, "What's up, Miami?" Or yeah. fuck? <laughs> I mean, fuck. when you're just in a dark room, like <laughs> God knows. Where That's I a go. big whiff, though. If you're in Ohio and you call Miami, or, <laughs> or you get up there and you like your voice cracks. You're like, "What's up?" <laughs> Wait, isn't there a Miami in Ohio? There is a Miami in Ohio, yeah. <laughs> no, there's not. Yeah, there there is. Is. Oh, my God. Maybe that was the one then. No, yeah, no, that, that, that was the one. That, one, that what, one flies. What is the best way to recover from that? Um, you just forget it. Well, you I just don't think forget you it. wouldn't even notice. Like, no one's going to come tell you. Yeah, no but one in the know. crowd is like, hey. But you're in your head as fuck, you know? I don't think you'd even know. Oh, like, you just fuck it up and you're just like, like fuck you, it. Yeah, oh, I fucked it. Like, because no one's going to come up and tell you in the middle of your set. That's fair. <laughs> Sometimes I try to like learn the language, like wherever I'm playing, I'll just like learn how to say like one, two, three in the language. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be in like China and I'll be like, e, air, sun. <laughs> so I'm sick. sure I fucked it up a couple of times. Just connect, pure you connect. said one, three, two. <laughs> <laughs> um, going off the microphone thing, what's the worst thing that you could ever say on the microphone? Or the worst thing you've heard someone else saying? 
I've definitely heard some bad ones. I've heard uh, DJs yelling at the crowd because they were like not dancing. For oh sure. my god! <laughs> oh really? That's yeah, I forget move. where this was, but like somebody was like yelling at the crowd because the crowd sucked, and but you know maybe the DJ wasn't playing what the crowd wanted. Yeah, to do, maybe that's yeah. on you, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo, yeah can you guys a, dance? One way to get the crowd going: insult them. You know? Yeah, that's what we want to be doing. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's just a bold call to assume they're just not into it, and it's you're playing dank stuff. Yeah, you know? you're like, my music's fire. This is this is <laughs> this is on them, not me, right? <laughs> you're just like, yo, I'm fire. I'm what are you, Mister Brightside, on repeat? Yeah. So I don't know. <laughs> Mr. Brightside future bass remix didn't hit. <laughs> Going off the Mr. Bright th- Brightside thing, what are uh, throwbacks that just don't hit anymore? Oh, Ooh. bro. It's, I realized I started getting old when I started playing um, some like the, I had the, these mashups I'd been playing in my DJ set and I just like replaced the drop every year, <laughs> but I keep the same <laughs> yeah. mashup. Yeah. One of them is like, DJ Cool, let me clear my throat. Like that shit used to go off like five, six, seven years ago when I was DJing and now you play let me clear my throat now and the crowd's just like, because the, the age of people who would know the that is just of, phased out. That's like, yeah, yeah you know? Yeah, they're like... That the, one and, um, you got a $100 bill, put your hands up. The Fat Man yeah, Scoop one. Yeah, the Fat Man Scoop one. Uh, what's it called? Um, Love Like This Before? Yeah, is that... Did Skrillex sample that for a record as well? Yeah. Uh, he redid, right? But, like, you play, like, though that era of hip-hop now, and, like... Like, 90s hip-hop? The crowd's yeah. just like, what is that? Yeah. Yeah, unless it's, like, one of the largest, like, records from that era. Like, people don't know, like, the OG, like, yeah, 90s hip-hop shit. So anymore. that's why, like, you hear, like, in a, a lot of the big tunes right now, you hear people sampling, like, more of the 2000s. It's like, it's 2000s like mid-2000s, stuff. like, R&B and, yeah. like, pop and yeah. shit. A lot yeah. of Black Eyed Peas. <laughs> I thought, I think my least favorite shit ever is when you play a song with two hooks at the same time. So, like, when people do a, they do a drop and then with also lyrics on it. Like, they'll do, like, animals, but also with lyrics on it. Oh, yeah, no, it's you like, can't be doing that. Like, there clashing. shouldn't be two, uh, like, hooks going on at, at the same time. No yeah, what. that's just not going Like, work. heads will roll with lyrics over it, too. Yeah, well, that's, like, that's why, like, the vocal house shit is pop- so popping right now, because it's the first, like, genre that's been popular where you can have a full verse on the drop, because yeah. the production's, like, understated enough to yeah. where you can and have a vocal. and the bass is, like, low, too. Exactly, so like, you can't have yeah. a massive big room lead and have a vocal, but you can have a fire yeah. bass line. Yeah, that shit's, like, what am I, which part am I listening yeah. to? Yeah, well, that you just shouldn't be playing animals in a set anymore, regardless. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're Martin Garrix. Oh, John another Garrix. one I used to play all the time was the Ying, uh, Ying Yang Twins, Get Low. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, that's no it. to the wall. Yeah. It, it usually has been going off, and then the lately, the last, like, two years, sometimes I play it, and it's just, like, kind of yeah. crickets. Yeah. It's, like, it's damn, str- I got to rotate these out because we're getting old. These 18-year-olds just don't, they don't, they don't <laughs> know it's, shit. It's a strictly <laughs> spring break one. What do you yeah. think the anth- anthems are for, like, the 18 year old, the newer ravers right now. Like if you had to play their version of what, of like that, what that would be to us. What do you think that is? Um, that's a really good question. Fuck. I thought we were doing the interview. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I honestly feel question. like most of the, do a early, I feel like most of the early 2000s st- shit is still popular among like, yeah, yeah. The early 2000s, but like, because they were like, in like, what's like some uh, of the middle school and shit. Think, maybe right? um, actually no. What's lower. like the equivalent to like a get low, you know? From music now or 2000s? No, like that. Like, if you were an 18 year old river and you walked into a festival and somebody played you a throwback, like a throwback. Show, what is the throwback that you were listening to when you were like 10? If you're, I that don't know age. about you, but, but I'm, I'm feeling 22. <laughs> I think it's like <laughs> it's, it's, it's probably like, like a Drake song. Or I was something. literally gonna say it's gotta Drake. be like a Drake song or yeah. something. Yeah, like fucking I'm on one or something. You know? Oh or yeah, what's that's the, fair. What's the other huge one that? Um, Fucking the other big DJ Khaled, all I do is win. I guess that, that's like, people, yeah, no, that's still uh, us. That's still us. That's definitely us, but yeah, it, that's but, me too. But that's, that's like, like on the cusp of those people would also know it, yeah. you know? Jay's over here still trying to figure out what animals is. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, there's a song like, called Animals? I didn't know we were talking about That's biology. one of the few ones I do know, actually. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Can you sing it for us? Off the top? I was just going to do that. I was just going to do that. I was, <laughs> that was pretty good. That was not bad. Yeah. I wasn't expecting you to go tongue acapella there. How did I hit the notes with my tongue? That was pretty impressive. Yeah. That might be a new talent for you. Yeah. All right. What else we got? Morgie Poo? I wanted to go off a uh, little Florida stuff real quick because I know you're from Florida. Oh yeah. oh, yeah. So I put a little segment together. Whole it's, Florida uh, segment. Yeah. It's, <laughs> There's a lot to discuss there. It's yeah. two truths or a lie. It's the rest of the podcast. Two <laughs> truths or and a lie Florida news edition. So I'm going to read you Ooh, Florida I news like headlines and you tell me which one's fake. All right. All right. You can uh, phone a friend for this one if you need it. So the first one is, Florida man stabs tourist despite having no arms. <laughs> <laughs> that could fucking be true. <laughs> this is the second one. Florida man gets tired of waiting at hospital, steals ambulance, and drives home. Oh, my God. Easily true. 
<laughs> They're all going to be true, man. This third one is Florida man charged with assault with a deadly weapon after throwing an alligator through a drive through window. Oh, my God. Okay, so we got the stab, we got the ambulance, and we got the, the alligator. alligator. All right, I know the alligator one's true because I've seen it before. Because that was my uncle. That one has to be true. That, one, <laughs> that one's true. That's not the only time if that's one of them happened. was him, still in, the the a- still in the ambulance, probably true. The first one's probably not real because how do you stab someone with no arms? Just on that basis of common sense. If you didn't have arms, you might be crafty with the feet or like the mouth or something. Wait, did you guys see that video? The guy with the no arms with the rolly backpack and he's got his shirt arm tied to the rolly backpack? Yeah, yeah, he's, oh, that's the Dave Portnoy. He's like, how's he pulling that? <laughs> and the guy walk, he walks past him with a, with a luggage thing tied to his like stump. Wow. Yeah. You got to get creative. Okay, so you're saying, what's the verdict here? He's saying Which the, one's not the, true? The, the yeah. no arms. Yeah. The first one's not true. The other two are true. They're all true. <laughs> 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 I fucking knew that I was so coming. I said that. <laughs> I was like, damn. I got, I got one more. One more set for you. Um, this one is, Florida man admits to killing and drinking goat for blood for sacrifice. Easily will true. still run for Senate. <laughs> goat for blood. Okay, we got goat for blood. Two, uh, Florida man arrested in local park for practicing karate on swans. <laughs> Three, Florida man arrested for dancing on patrol car to escape vampires. Hmm. Dude, they're all fucking true. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Go, they're it's all true. All true. Okay. It's my favorite shit ever. I was literally trying to- Six th- truths, no lies. I found this website of like 20 of them, and I was looking at them, and I was like, I can't come up with anything- that beats any of these. Yeah. They're all, I mean, because in Florida, we've got our classic meth heads. You know, you've got your gator swamp people. So that's just classic news across the board. I couldn't think of anything that would. I grew up in the swamp, kind of. You grew up in the I swamp? I grew up in a place called Jupiter Farms, and it's out in the middle of nowhere. And there would just be alligators coming up the driveway. Just no around. way. I swear to God, bro. Wait. So they would kill, the alligators would come into our thing, and they would kill the ducks and the, the geese in our fucking front yard. And we wake up and there would just be feathers and dead ducks and shit everywhere. Jesus. And so my um, stepdad back in the day, he would just fucking get the rifle out and he would open our front door and he would snipe the gators from inside our house. This is like where I live, dude. Truth. That's this is the truth. <laughs> that so the gators true. would come up trying to kill all these like ducks in our yard and Jesus, shit. And he would be like, dude. Wait, so uh, speaking of gators... I looked up how fast they can run. If you guys had to guess. Oh, it's like 30. 20 miles an hour? Yeah, it's 15 Shut to 20 miles an hour. That's why you got to run zigzags if they chase dude, you. you have to the, be on. <laughs> you have to be Dude, what I'm a Florida man. Fuck? I'm, a, I'm secretly dude, a Florida you man. Are, you are the Florida <laughs> man. All right. So our last musical related topic here. Worst and best karaoke song choices. Oh. <laughs> you could take a second. Well, one time I was in college and we had this like Sunday night karaoke thing. And what we started doing is start signing people's names up on the, on the fucking thing. Like that just people you were with? Like just people that we yeah. knew would be like awkward on the stage. <laughs> the, people, the guy in the cr- cr- like group who was like, hell no, I'm not doing it. And you're like, come yeah, on like cool guy. <laughs> like, so like one of my best friends, he's my roommate. And he was just like, he was like an MMA fighter, like total cool guy, like never would be on stage karaoke. And we're like, yo, let's go sign Justin up for karaoke. Guess what song we did? That was... We put Crazy Town, Yuma Butterfly, Sugar, oh, baby. Oh, that's a good, that's a good jam. <laughs> the whole bar, he's like, no, fuck you guys. I'm not doing it. The whole bar started Chaining chanting, his name. Justin, Justin. He had to get up on stage <coughs> and sing Yuma Butterfly, <laughs> Sugar, <laughs> baby. Come, my lady. Come, come, my lady. That's a, that's good, a that's fucking a banger. banger that's a banger. Yeah. But yeah. at the time, though, it was like, that's not the song you want to be carrying. That, wasn't, that yeah. wasn't the one. You know? It That's the worst one, though. What, what's, what would be your, like, absolute go-to, like, favorite for you? Sweet Caroline. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> that is my worst. That's I have worst. that as my worst. Straight That's up. Worst. That's the fucking worst. I was, I was talking about this with someone the other day, and we are like, yo, what is, like, the absolute worst college songs to, like, sing at the end of the night? And that's like it's that or like fucking wagon wheel blow my brains oh, out. Oh, hold on, okay. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Wait, wagon speaking of Mo Bamba, a banger. Mo Bamba would go hard. Oh, are you dude. shitting me? That would be okay. That's that would, that would be like hard. a skill to kind of like show yeah. like you know the whole thing. I got <laughs> shit. <laughs> God, uh, we, for should my, we all just go best first, and then we'll all go worst. Well, he already did worst. And I said Sweet Caroline, so you go worst. Oh, yeah. my worst. Um, I got YG, my ninja. Just because you literally wouldn't be able to sing it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> because every other word would be, yeah. nuh-uh. You could just be up there just like, my, 
My, uh, my, mm-hmm. uh, everyone, in the, they'd all be just be watching you. They'd be like, my brother, my brother. <laughs> <laughs> That's a toughie. My worst one is a uh, chop suey system of a down. Oh my God. How does that go? <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, that one. Wake well, up. Whoa. Isn't that down with the sickness? Is that down with the sickness? Yeah, but chop suey would also be horrible. Okay. Down with the I sickness. I think chop suey would be kind of lit though. The whole bar would go off, no? Yeah, I think you were thinking of down with the sickness. I was thinking of down with the yeah. sickness. Whatever that one is, we go, wow. That, that would go off. Had to, if you so could do hard, it, though. if you could do it, it would be sick. Chop suey thinking. is like the super like monotone like one. That, I don't know if it no, would that's No, that that's the one. Yeah, I know that one. Yeah. Okay, I mix them up. I mix There's them up. There's clips of GTA playing chop suey. They play it in yeah, their they used sets, to have like a, a but the shit goes off, man. They used to have Everybody. a sick, or they have a sick like remix or edit of it. That yeah, maybe it's their yeah. yeah. edit remix. It's fucking dope. Um, my goat, Mr. Brightside, hundred percent. Mr. Brightside for goat. And that's my go-to every time. That's okay. a classic. Yeah. Let's go. Uh, let's go. Woat. Fuck. Best one. No, what, what, is worse. Here it is worse. Oh, he that said, was supposed to be worse. Oh wait, he said he Sweet said Caroline worse. was worse. Well, that was your oh, best that, one. No, that was my worst. That was get my worst. it. I was gonna get it. Okay, so goat. Goat. No, just said it. Oh, um, <laughs> god damn! Wait, dude. hold on. Someone turn switch him on. Bro. Turn your brain <laughs> on, dude. What the fuck is going on? Wait, I just thought I would, get this oh. guy another Pacifico. Love so one god. thing that I thought would be fucking hilarious to do is would be to just to do an EDM song. Oh, like, like with, no, just, with no lyrics. Like if you did animals, <laughs> it just does no words. I'm not even talking fucking animals. There's one yeah. lyric. Or if you did like levels or something, that'd be lit. And then so I had for the one I writ, wrote down was um, "Jizz in My Pants, Lonely Island." I think. <laughs> That's what you would go with? <laughs> That's that would be go with. I'm on a boat. <laughs> yeah, I'm on a boat. <laughs> when I jizz in, in my pants. <laughs> I forgot about that one. Yeah, That's dick in a box would be I, fire to you. Yeah. It's dick, my in a- dick in a box. Or is that was just was that just an SNL skit? That no, wasn't like a oh, you just song. I think that was the same guys. Yeah. It was it was when Justin Timberlake hosted SNL. It was yeah. so but it was with Andy Samberg. Yeah. That was that was them. My best one? What's your go to? I mean, my classic go to is uh I wrote Sins on Tragedies. Oh yeah, okay, for this guy. Right, oh right. come on, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. that's yeah. fucking all time. And the that's... other one that we thought of the other day that would be lit would be um, the SpongeBob theme song. Oh SpongeBob, if you could hit that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <ready> kids. <laughs> <laughs> and the crowd's like, I, I can't do it. You gotta hope for crowd performance. Yeah, yeah, you need some crowd help. When I was uh, I was like touring in China sometime, and they're like bringing you back to these like these clubs are like super clubs, and they have like crazy green rooms. Uh-huh. And sometimes they bring you back in the green rooms, and they bring you to these like karaoke rooms, but like high level karaoke rooms where it's like they have all the equipment and stuff. And like one time I was just like chilling in there, me and like two or three people, and then they like brought in these like karaoke girls, <laughs> and I was like what's going on? And then like the lady just comes up to the thing and she just picks a song and she starts just like singing some Chinese song to us. And we're just like sitting there. <laughs> getting a full on performance in the getting green room. Getting a performance in the green room. And That's I was like, epic. I was like kind of lit. I was like, this yeah. is cool. Yeah, there's a place in LA. It's called like a lot of them do it. Red Dragon or something. And it's like private karaoke room. So you get like groups of like 10. That's like the thing to do. It's so yeah, sick. It's yeah. it was, like, it's it's kind of fun. so fun. Yeah. Because yeah. then it's like less... Everyone's like more comfortable, nah, you know. What I mean? need the whole crowd. And they have like yeah. it's like bottle service. <laughs> if I'm gonna perform, I need the crowd there. Yeah, I mean, there's something about singing a shitty song to a bunch of strangers there, yeah, that just yeah. hits different. Yeah. Just would you, your would you guys sing up there? Uh, would you guys sing Crazy Town Butterfly? I would. Say, Wait, is that, I don't what, know what is this song called? Actually, I, I don't know. Butterflies. The, yeah, it's called Butterfly. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I would abs- I would rip that. <laughs> now that I think about it, I, so I thought this one was gonna hit. I forget if you were there for it, but I, I did. There. You were there? I did a Natasha, I would, was it Unwritten? Or? Unwritten. Yeah. Dude, I did Natasha Bedingfield Unwritten. It didn't go and off. And it bombed. It, not only did it bomb. bomb. Is that the feel the rain on your skin? How is that possible? It's, it's, good. it's like, I am unwritten. Da-na-na-na. What's the one that goes, feel the rain on that's, your that's skin? That's it. That's that. That's right. the hook. Yeah. Dude, and just for whatever reason, the whole bar was just like, What's what? the no, not only oh, did you it know what would be a banger? What's the one that goes making my way downtown? Dun, oh, dun, 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 dun. Uh, is that Vanessa Carlton? Dun, 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 dun. That's, that show would go that's off. The go, that's, <laughs> that's, that's Vanessa that's Carlton, the go, right? I think so. Yeah, but what, what was I, it? I could fall <laughs> into that. That's sky. a good one. <laughs> <laughs> why did that? Why did it go so bad for me? Well, so it not only went, but it was so bad that they fake cut the mic. <laughs> Oh, they yeah, were like, oh, oh, we lost power. They were like, oh, the song cut out. Someone pulled like, the breaker on the entire club. As they're speaking on the other mic and it's working. <laughs> <laughs> no, like, oh, this isn't working. So next up we have, <laughs> dude, and I paid, I paid $20 to go to the front of the line for this shit. Oh, wow. And I was with a bunch of people, including a girl. Wait, you can pay to cut the line? Yeah, I had to pay a, a dub. <laughs> yeah, to, you can grease the line. Someone's low-key banking, dude. Yeah. yeah. Bro, but I went, I was with 
like five people didn't know that well, and I went back to the table, that and was I was rough. just like sweating fucking bullets. That was that rough. did not tried go to, well. Tried You're to drenched. That one off. Your shirt's yeah. soaking wet. Fucking Christ! Good sweating cool. through a jacket. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like it just was terrible. Fully sweating through a hoodie. Okay, uh, wait, one more quick one because I forgot we had this one. Uh, fuck Mary, kill the three of us, and why? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, bro. <laughs> well, you're going to find out. Fuck, Mary, kill. There we go. <laughs> uh, I'll take that. Just, just, we're, just one, two, three. You, gotta line, you picked the wrong Mary. I'll tell you that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, we, we go I'm hard, fine dude. with the kill for me. But and I'm a mediocre fuck as well. You blew this one. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you the wrong Mary, dude? Because uh, I, so, I, I think I'm the best Mary. Oh, my goodness. We'd never get bored, man. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Sweet fucking Christ. All right, you want to fire off your, your thingies? Yeah, we just got a couple little fun debate topics, you know. Uh, goat fast food chain. Goat fast food chain? Yeah. I already know yours. Henry, what's yours? I got a hot take. And I want, I want your exact <laughs> order from that place. Oh, man. Uh, the best one is Five Guys. Five guys. Really? Five, five guys. That's a bold claim. Dude, it's okay. better than In and Out. It's Ooh. better than all. Are we the, all team In and Out? We got one? five guys in here. Oh wow. We do have five yeah, guys. Our, our dude, five good guys friend is, Forbes is here laying on the fucking floor. <laughs> uh, five <laughs> guys is a bold call. Our beer bitch. But it's, I do it's a bold call, <laughs> but it's it's actually better. It's a fact. I no, do like kidding. how you can customize the shit out of it at five guys. It is good as fuck. But it's yeah. like fifteen dollars versus that, four. That is the only problem. Is it? Dude, if you get a like combo at Five Guys, it's like fifteen bucks. If you get like a shake, fries, burger, dude, and they, the you just walk crushed. in and they have the peanuts everywhere, and it's like, yeah, it's a nice touch. I nice like touch. Five Guys, and I think it's easily up there. But I'm an in. I'm a Chick Fil A guy. guy too. Oh, I oh love Chick Fil A is good. Chick Fil A is so fun. It's so simple, and I don't know. I can't explain it. There's just yeah. like only two pickles on this fucking thing, and it's so good. And it's just like you just want to eat it, which is yeah. kind of bullshit that they still get away with that. If you're being honest, yeah, you at least throw two and no sauce. Like I have I mean, to sauce I, it myself. I house it in Polynesian, you know. Yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah. Po- Polynesian's the way to go. Oh I am, yeah. I am a little peanut slut at Five Guys though. Yeah, you're a nut. <laughs> you're a nut slut. <laughs> I'm a nut slut. My favorite part is I just get to be a complete piece of shit and just throw them on the floor. <laughs> you mm-hmm. know, done with my burger. He gets to be normal and it's and it's normal for everybody. <laughs> yeah, else. I think I get to be myself at Five Guys. Yes. When I first moved here, I'm I was like, guys. <laughs> I was like, In and Out's the best. When I first moved here from Florida, I'd never seen In and Out in my life. I ate it every single night after I went out. When I first moved here, so you're still a big fan. But like I just overdid it. You burn yourself out. <laughs> yeah, I burn out. I've done I that like, with so I'm many done, places. Man. Chipotle for me, I've I've run run myself thin on. I used to eat it four or five times a week. I still eat it. I still eat it, but I've like <laughs> curbed to like I've curbed it back to like maybe once every other week. That's fair. I eat that once you, a day. You know how at Five Guys they have the wall where you could draw shit, like a chalk wall or whatever. No, they no, have, they you have draw the, art the little. Wall. They have, you get like a piece of paper, right? Yeah, they have the. And you can oh, draw. you go and paint I it on saw there. the best thing I've ever seen my whole fucking Wait, life. I think I was with you. I can't remember what it was. It's the. Five guy human centipede. <laughs> oh someone, have you seen human centipede? Oh, no. true, five guys you logo? haven't seen human centipede? No. Nah. Okay, I haven't so, seen it, but I know. So long story <laughs> story, it's like a horror movie about this doctor that ties people mouth to oh, ass. Oh, okay, I've heard yeah. of this. Fuck and this. someone drew five dudes in a human centipede <laughs> on the wall. And I was just like, you're kidding me. You're sick. And I that person was me. <laughs> <laughs> Best shit I've ever seen, because I did it. Uh, uh, all right, what's your... What's, well, goat. Okay, so goat fast food. Well, we really missed on the fast fire. Here. Well, I never heard your order. My order from Five Guys. What do you? Oh, you I just get the burger with fucking everything on it, with the mushrooms and the onions and all that. All just, just food. load that just, fucker yeah. up. Yeah, yeah. Double, I'm assuming. Yeah, yeah. You got it. One uh, patty's not enough. Yeah, I'm a born and raised caniac. Yeah, you putting that over yeah, T-Bell I'm, for you? I don't eat T-Bell that much anymore. I would have thought you were gonna say Taco Bell 100. percent No, I'm a caniac. I Raising got, Canes I got is up there for Raising sure. Raising Canes is good, dude. Yeah. I'm, I'm putting got, I'm putting Raising Canes and In and Out on the oof, same level. I different forgot category. about Raising Canes, man. And this episode just, is it's just not accessible sometimes. Yeah. There's no locations, dude. It's it's tough to find. Orange Where? County has a shitload of them. LA doesn't have hardly any. That's every time I get it, I'm on the way from Orange yeah. County. It's creeping into San Diego. We've got two locations yeah. now. There's a third one popping up near me. Yep. Um, yeah. So you're keeping that a secret. You weren't gonna tell me there's a canes? Yeah, I should. Well, went, last time we went to Raising Canes, we got the gear. Yeah, we got. They, a, sell, yeah. they sell t-shirts for ten dollars. That's a steal. That's the cheapest t-shirt you can in this get. economy. What a yeah. steal! Like it yeah. costs that much to make a shirt. Yeah, <laughs> but so I get the Caniac combo. I used to do extra toast, but I'm a gluten god now. Yeah, you're. He's, so. he's a celiac. He can't eat gluten. Mm. Yeah, gluten god. <laughs> <laughs> the opposite of that. Yeah. yeah, so I do the Caniac combo with the biggest fucking lemonade in the world, <laughs> and so much ketchup. 
Oh, yeah. You sold them the, out oh, I had four the sauces. Four sauces. I feel like I stopped there in the pandemic a lot. The one in OC. Where's uh, It's right off of like. Um, I know exactly. It's like that. Anaheim or some yeah, shit. Yeah, it's like literally you can yeah. see it from the freeway. It's like right there. Yeah, I stopped that one a lot. You? You know me. T-Bell? I'm a Taco Bell. Uh, through and through. Yeah, I'm a T-Bell Towers a Taco Bell, Bell boy. boy. <laughs> T-Bell Towers. And you're not going to catch me walking out there without a Baja Blast. <laughs> okay, if the fries are there. I'm eating in. <laughs> <laughs> you can't take those to go. I'm not going to take those to go. I'm going to get them while they're you fresh. Get, you get your food from the drive-thru park and then yes, go inside. Go inside. <laughs> I could fuck a bunch of cheesy gordita crunch. Oh, cheesy time. gordita yeah. crunch. So good. That's With a fiery move. shell? Woo. Mm. No, the fiery no, shell. No, the fiery shells off. are gone, right? It's fuck just off fire shells. Dorito shell. Fuck off with your fire shells. Those are bad. Wow, fuck off to you. I'm fair with that. <laughs> and then I got to get a crunch wrap. Crunch wrap supreme. Those are kind of a cap for Wait, me. did you know this? You can sub out beef for chicken on those, and they're dummy fire. Really? They're dummy? Yeah. Shit. But yeah, I'm a, you know me. It's like at yeah, least. No, I, I, I thought you were both going to say Taco It's Bell. at least twice a week, yeah, I'd say. you're a fucking demon. Uh, I think I'm just going to have to go in now. You know, double, double. Actually, I get a three, right. three by three uh, fries, half strawberry, half vanilla shake. It's, it's game over. Shake. That's fair. I, got, shake. I got one kind of like that. Uh, would you rather everything in your life be hot or everything in your life be cold. Now we're talking across the board. We're talking weather. We're talking showers. We're talking food. I'm going hot. Hot. 100%. Hot? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Hot food, hot showers, hot weather, You're hot l- women. Let's go. Uh, okay. <laughs> I didn't think about that. Oh, uh, yeah. Cold. Uh, I kind of like yeah. a, cold, a cold mean girl, though. Well, she's cold hearted. No. Yeah, cold hearted. She's hard ripping bad. Like, she's bad, but she's cold. Yeah. 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 I'm going cold. She's a 10, but she's yeah. cold. Cold blooded. You're going cold? Yeah. yeah. I'm cold all day. So are you crazy. move to the fucking, you know, middle of the Himalayas? No, nah, I should just blast the fucking AC. So it's room. snowing 24-7. It doesn't think have to be about, that cold. Think about, say how cold. Think about this on Team Hot, right? Your car's Get hot. Get in your car, leather sticking to your pants. Dude, I'm like you're hot. You're, I, you're blazing. You're sweating. And I, what do you reach for? A hot bottle of water. Because you can only have oh, everything hot. I'm going cold. I don't care. We, we got to figure out a way to phrase the cold shit bad. Yeah, right? You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, cold-hearted I mean, cold, homies. Cold food. Ice cream. Cold showers. Cold showers would be the toughest thing to get around, but I would do cold it. Cold weather. What, that, what, what, what if you live in Alaska and you have to wake up and take a cold shower? Okay, yeah. I didn't say. It's, it's 20 it. degrees oh. outside and you take a cold shower. Fuck that. It's cold, not glacial. Okay, it's well, not. Well, we didn't define the range. Okay, <laughs> it's just fair. cold. It's just on the edge of cold. You got to wear a sweater. So you're building that mental toughness all day long. Yeah. yeah well, I'm at the beach, bitch, you know? Yeah. I could be at the beach. It's just a little chilly. Out. Cold sand. <laughs> hey, cold sand. Cold sand hits. So does the you're cold side it. of a pillow. I'm yeah, going you're, hot. So you're sleeping in a warm too. bed. You're I don't sweating care. In bed. I'm going hot. Right, right. Mine, what, what, what you got you're for not, us? You're not here to oh, change my mind. Only hot. A hot guy? Yeah, we're hot. We're hot dudes. Dude, I grew, <laughs> I grew hot up in dudes. Florida. The, the sticky leather and the open I car. I love swamp ass. Makes what me feel at What alcohol are you drinking on Team Hot? Sake. Fuck off. The whole rest of your life? Yeah, hot sake. Done. Easy. Soup? How many soups? How many soups can we eat that are hot? Yeah. Pho, ramen, yeah. anything. Enjoy your cold That's bowl right. of pho. Oh, well, I'm Idiot. obviously not ordering Idiot. pho. Enjoy your cold in. T-bone steak, dumbass. You ever had cold pho, though? No. Exactly. It so. gets coagulated from the yeah, animal it, oils. It, right. it, turns into, <laughs> it turns into like a fucking... <laughs> Every <laughs> part ramen in the fridge. Gelatinous. It's just cold gelatinous. Like it turns into jello. Gelatinous. All right, that one, I like that, that one. one pissed me off. I like that one. All right, let's see. Well, the mm, mm. this one like ties into the other one. I'm just gonna say like favorite cuisine overall. You know, I'm a big uh, Asian food fan. Obviously, well, like if you could only <laughs> eat one for the rest of your life, I think I'd have to go the same. Yeah, Asian? I, I would. F- I fuck up Chinese. Asians food. up there for yeah. me. Thai yeah. food. Oh. Well, I don't know if you're allowed to classify it as just Asian food. You know, what I'm mean? going Thai because there's Japanese. I had Thai Chinese, food last night. There's Vietnamese. So good. Yeah. So but I have to pick. I think one you have to pick them. one because Asian food's way too overarching. Of course. You, you have Let's to be like Japanese, Chinese, Japanese, Vietnamese, Japanese, Japanese. Yeah. They have the soups and they have the sushi and, the sushi. and they have the. Yeah, I'm with that. The and barbecue like, stuff. They and do, they yeah, have yeah, the, yeah. I'm with that. Chinese, I love, but like. A lot of it's. I'm a sucker for a fried rice, dude. I know, dude. I'm a Thai boy, but like, <laughs> I feel like you can get fried rice in like a Japanese restaurant for sure, right? Hopefully, yeah. Yeah, you could get fried rice just about anywhere. Yeah. Okay. Then Mexican it's- food, fried rice. God <laughs> 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 damn it, it's too good. <laughs> yeah, I was either gonna go Mexican or like Japanese for sure. Sorry for shutting that down. That was just out of character for me. That's just out yeah, of character I mean, for him. <laughs> so last sorry. time I checked, you're not in charge of what yeah, I get to I'm ask. I'm so you know sorry. I mean? All right. We got truth or drink coming up. 
Oh, okay. Well, we're already drinking, so how do we take this to another echelon? Just, just take an, another drink. My Asian red face is kicking in now after one. Like, <laughs> it, like if you have to drink, you, you guys are gonna to see like, the Asian red face go it, from nothing. Yeah, it's, it's, gonna it. just, it's escalating. It's rapidly. escalating quickly. Oh, it's gonna get hot. The pink, the pink tint really brings out the red face. Yeah. There you go. Um, where's, so, my, where's my sunglasses at? What if we, what if we up the ante? And if you, if you, if you opt for drink, it's like finish Funny your one. drink. No. <laughs> what? We like, like to tr- really well, motivate you to have to answer the questions, you know. All right. Like it's supposed to be a punishment. Well, we'll do half. Maybe let's half. go. A, let's go a three gulper. You know, a, a big, triple gulp. A yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, a triple gulp. I have gulp. to go. Uh, I don't drive. want to be blacked out by the time this. I is have over. to drive, so I'll double down. Okay. Um, <laughs> I gotta. I gotta be in normal condition later on. <laughs> no, yeah, no, we're not trying to get you too fucked up here. Um, let's see. It's, it is a party though, so. Yeah. All right. We're blacking out. <laughs> we'll Uber you there. Okay. <laughs> Um, if your sex life had a movie title, what would it be? Disappointment. 40-Year-Old Virgin, the trilogy. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that. Let me think of some movie titles for a second. Well, that's not a truth or drink. Yeah, well, how is that a truth or drink? Because if you don't want to answer, because it's so embarrassing. I mean, you could just come up with a different title. Trash, dude. <laughs> how, do you, how are you so trash? Okay, mine's going to be Inception, then. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dream within a dream within a dream. That's fire. Uh, oh, like, pick uh, a movie that already exists? That's oh, yeah, I thought yeah, you meant... No, I, think that's good, that's good. I thought you meant just name it. I was like, yeah. I didn't no, say if, anything. It, had a movie title. Like, uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So mine is Inception, <laughs> Welcome to the Dream within a Dream. Okay, within a dream. okay. Okay, <laughs> okay I like that. <laughs> Uh, oh shit, the Dark Knight. <laughs> <laughs> he's not the hero we need, but he's the hero we deserve. <laughs> oh, that's good. I need a second for that one. That's the hit. Uh, Damn, I was, I was thinking Batman too, right? Before you said <laughs> yeah, that. yeah it's, a, it's a good one. I got a good one. Here we go. Henry Fong, the movie. <laughs> Return of the Dragon. Yes. 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 <laughs> That's yes. another good one. I was Damn previously it. in a long relationship. So, you know. Yeah. Return. <laughs> return. The and dragon's I, back, baby. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I have to drink for that one just because I can't think of a good one. That's fair. You guys caught me off guard with that. Yeah. Okay. Um, Batman versus Superman. <laughs> <laughs> Batman versus Superman. At least be Iron uh, Man. Iron Man, there or you be go. Be Iron Man. That's, <laughs> this is another good one. I love you, man. That's what I was just going to say. <laughs> <laughs> Step Brothers. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. That's good shit. Oh, it is hot in here, boys. Oh, holy shit. Wow. Okay, um, your number one red f- or your top green red flag. Uh, let me let me wow. fucking start. Ooh. Take a moment. La, 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 Take all the time la, you need la, 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 to not do that again. Um, your worst red flag and your best green flag. I could tell you my worst red flag. Disney adults is my worst red flag. <laughs> What does that mean? Like adults like a, who are like worship adults Disney, adults who, who are like super into Disney. They got like a tattoo, backpack, season passes. Yeah. Oh, so you're going red flag and green flag for other people? Oh, you were saying for me? I, I think we could do both. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, you I was doing my worst red flag. Yeah, like your own personal red flag. Like what is a red flag of mine? I'm not going to disclose. Yeah, that. no. Okay. I'm, I'm yeah, saying for other people. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Why would people. I tell everyone why they never want to date me? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, we'll do other people. You know, people listen to this. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so, so yeah. skip, I'll drink. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I'm sticking with Disney adults for my red. For other people, green flag? Mm-hmm. I have so many reds, but so few greens. Another reds is if a girl... Your reds is just fun to talk about. Yeah, reds are good. <laughs> um, give me a second for greens. Hit another... Hit, you guys hit yours. I mean, lower back tat, red flag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. See, that's, a, that's in my greens. <laughs> <laughs> I think... Uh, Burping and farting has to be my <laughs> flag. For yourself? No, for others. For a girl? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then green has to be lower back tat. <laughs> <laughs> if it's tasteful, you know? If it, says, if it says like someone's name. What if it's a Disney lower back tat? <laughs> <laughs> it, it goes to green. It's like a little it's mushu- a Mickey Mouse. It's a Mushu. A Mickey Mouse yeah. pointing down. Yeah. <laughs> what do we got, Henry? Mine's got a series, I guess, but dude, when they're on the phone too much, 
Oh yeah, oh, yeah. big yeah. red flag. Yeah. Like always on the fucking yep. Instagram shit, yeah. dude. Yeah, it's annoying as fuck. And then the green flag is when they're not always on their phone. Yeah, right. Yeah, that's a when they're able to like actually even, exist in reality. Even yeah. when I'm with my friends, it's like I'm trying to not. We are here to right now. Yeah, I mean, the only time I, that I'd be doing that is if we're like hungover, laying on a couch. Together. Yeah, yeah. But like, I'm trying not to be on my phone if I'm like engaging yeah. with the boys. You know, we're getting through these beers. Uh, yeah, we're kind of motoring through. <laughs> <laughs> Would you guys say you're in your prime drinking age? Yeah. Prime party phase? I'm pretty like elite at this point. I in see time. your guys' story and I'm like, oh my God, I'm tired. Dude. <laughs> watch. We um, are we are definitely like the you guys go peak, hard. peak partying right now. Which I thought we'd be slowing down by it's now, but it's not. It's not happening. You were like scared. <laughs> yeah. Where were we? Okay. Yeah, Miami took a toll for sure. A couple years off the line. I'd say we're definitely- <laughs> We definitely can't move there. We'd die. We're in prime drinking age just because I know how much I can drink. I mean, the yeah, yeah. My, I know my limits so well that yeah. I just go to it every time. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> I think I, I peaked at like 23. Really? 23 to 25. Like I'd say the last month. When did you start drinking though? 15. 15. Really? See, see, for me and more- I didn't start drinking until like legit 18. Yeah, college. see, I think we also- I, I, I didn't start in like high school at all. Oh, really? Yeah, we yeah. were just like rambunctious little rascals. We didn't really party. So going on this, t- at this, on blah, blah, blah. You're on Dude. fly, red leather. Dude, English English leather. Leather. Might as well be my second fucking language because- Yeah, uh, and what's the first? <laughs> fucking nonsense? Gibberish? Yeah, absolutely nonsense. Jesus, Morgology? So at what point do you know you're too drunk? When I wake up in a pool of my own- piss. The spins, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the spins. The spin is good. Oh, yeah, I think that's way past when I know. But to be fair, <laughs> oh yeah, that's like super late yeah. actually. That's like when you uh, get home and you're just like, oh. Yeah, that's usually like at the end. Well, oh, I got yeah. I got my natural red face indicator. Yeah, there you yeah. go. You got yeah, the, yeah, the yeah, litmus yeah. test. <laughs> you have a color. You have a color grading system. <laughs> nope, I'm, I'm only at burnt orange. <laughs> <laughs> It's usually when I pile it on fast, like if I was like shot, shot, boom, yeah. red. It's the shots that fucking yeah. take you overboard. I think for me, it's when I start forcing other people to drink. <laughs> It's yeah, like, yeah. Because you're like, holy fuck, I'm so drunk. Yeah. I need someone with I'm me. I'm like, hack the pace. Yeah. Hack the when pace. you were screaming hack the pace in Miami, I was like, bro, we're hammered. There's no hacking pace. Well, the here. other night. At, we're at full throttle. Is this, is this mine? That's mine. The other night at Bang Bang, he's literally pouring out my water bottles into the, into the plant. <laughs> I'm grabbing a water bottle because I'm way too drunk. And, and he's, he's not he letting you drink water. He's like, he's like, oh, let me see that. And he grabs he's it and just <laughs> pours it out. Why do you let you drink water? I watered the fake plant, yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Garrett, it's when uh, you start uh, just talking to people forever. I mean, I kind of do that always. I start talking loud, too. So, like, when you're in the you're like, hey, what's up? And you're, like, talking so loud, and then people start, like, getting away from you when you're talking to them. That's yeah. how you know you're too That drunk. happens yeah. to me when I'm not drunk. Or I guess it's when I'm talking to a group of strangers and I haven't seen my friends in two hours. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. that's it. That, yeah. When hey, I'm like, these are my best friends. What are you talking <laughs> about? That's it, for sure. Okay, um, let me see here. Imagine we are your future children. Give us the bird and bees talk. Ooh. Well, he has a son, so he can... He's, but yeah, whatever he's you seven years him. old, so we're yeah, not there so we're yet. not there yet. But, but have you, like, rehearsed it already? Do you know... Oh, he's asked before, like, he'll ask, like... Where do babies come from? He's yeah, kind of it's like the that. classic question, right? And basically, you just say the daddy puts a seed in the mommy. Yep. And a baby which grows, and then accurate. a baby grows in the belly, which is accurate. Boom. A hundred percent. That's accurate. it. That's that's to the point. Yep. So what uh, what about like the fifteen year old talk or like the fourteen? <laughs> what do you think it is? Like twelve? It's usually high school. I feel like my dad never gave me the talk. I, I never, never got, got a talk either. either. My I got, dad and I never forget up. this. The talk from my dad. We're sitting. He says we're going for a ride. We get in the truck. No, <laughs> sit back. He, we, he's never done anything like this. We're going for a ride in the truck, and he's just driving around in complete silence for like twenty minutes. And I'm like, "What's going on?" And then he looks at me, and he just goes, "You use a condom, right?" I was like, "Uh, yeah." <laughs> and he's like, "All right." And that was it. I, I <laughs> that was the whole. That's so scary. Dude. Wow. I was like, I thought I was gonna get like, I thought I was trying to think of everything I did wrong to that point. I'm oh, running God. through the whole thing. Oh yeah. I think uh, we're in like an era where there's just so much online and stuff that like kids figure it out well before it apparent. Yeah, you know, I think would so. think yeah. they would even. Yeah, where you think about. when you said fifteen, I was thinking for no, his kids, like, he's probably gonna be like nine. No, yeah, it, I, <laughs> <laughs> he took a drink for I got, that. I got, <laughs> I got mine like the night before I was about to start my freshman year of high school. He's like, oh, you know, when you're in the locker room with some like the older guys because I was like on the baseball team, and he's like, they're probably gonna be talking about you know all the stuff with girls and stuff and. 
you know, just kind of went from there and talked about it. Seems like you had the best experience. With yes. <laughs> I never got one. That's I crazy. didn't get one either. Well, you didn't have a dad. Well, your dad wasn't there. <laughs> <laughs> Not funny at all, but. It's kind of funny. It's kind of funny. <laughs> okay, so we nailed that one. <laughs> Thank you all for that. Why did you act like that's a soft subject all of a sudden? <laughs> we talked about that our entire lives. No. I can't wait for that edit. I'm just going to put like a fucking <laughs> a 21 Savage song. Meme. Uh, okay. Um, tell us the time that you first discovered porn. Well, back in my day, we had magazines. <laughs> magazines, for sure. Magazines? Yeah, it was a magazines. And then uh, we were hardly even at the era where... Our, mine you was can, magazines oh, too. Oh, yeah. I was in like a summer camp one year or something, and these fucking kids on the bus had the magazines. Had nudie mags. Oh, that's fair. That's a yeah. cool way to discover it. Yeah, that's for how, sure. That's how I discovered Dude, it. Dude, I used to hide Really? Like, yeah, my, I, I, when I first, I found a magazine, like a whatever it fucking was, a hustler, and I took it, and I was Hustler's looking at dirty, it in the bathroom. Hustler's dirty, bro. I was looking at it in the bathroom, <laughs> and I remember I put it in my backpack, and I took it to school. And we're on the playground looking at it. What yeah, age was this? Uh, it was like sixth or seventh grade maybe. <laughs> but I'll never forget, I, the like bell rings and we panic and my friend takes it and he puts it under his shirt. <laughs> you <laughs> couldn't just put it back in the backpack. Yeah, right. Yo, let he, me he, hold this, I got us. Yeah, <laughs> he's like, so he puts it under his shirt and he's walking with his fucking hand on his shirt and we're like getting in line to go back into class. And he trips and falls. <laughs> oh, God. And it, <laughs> it sprays out right under the teacher's feet. Like a, no like a scene out of a movie. It literally movie. just sh- it literally shoots up, right bro. under their feet. And he, she picks it up and she's like, okay. And she's like, she's like, John. And I forget his name. She's like, principal's office right now. And I'll never forget, we're sitting in the principal's office and he's looking at me. He's like, I got you, bro. I'm not going to say anything. I'm, I'm, I will not rat you out, bro. I got you. And they, co- they call us into the principal's office and he's like, I got it from him. <laughs> I knew that was coming. Wow. And I was like, damn, dude, you sold me out like that. Not realizing it says my name an address on, oh, the, the, on the thing that's delivered to the house. I hope it was your first name, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my name is George. No, that was the best pickup ever from school because you get picked up and your mom's asking, so how did school go today? What's going on? And I'm like, just sitting there and I'm like, nothing, regular day. Not even thinking about it. Then your she, dad out of the water. And then absolutely, I'll never forget, I'm sit, she's like, wait in your room for your dad to come home. I can't believe you lied to me. And he comes in and he's, he, the only thing he says to me is like, God damn it, now I can't have those magazines anymore. <laughs> <laughs> not even mad I found it he's just like I gotta get rid of it. well he's like you blew my shit yeah, yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you fucked me uh, so for me it was 6th grade I was watching South Park and they talk about it so me and my friend Sean I'm at so- the time there's like a computer in the living room and we, we like fucking we gotta see what it's about <laughs> and we're like deep into it like we got a favorite chick and shit at this point <laughs> and it, we hear his dad just start to open the door and we're just like oh fuck like fumbling the whole keyboard 30, oh, yeah. 30 tabs open. and then, <laughs> and then he, he comes in and we're just like on google and both look at the door <laughs> just like what <laughs> it just says boobies in the search bar <laughs> are you kidding like yeah mine was definitely just a I think it was me um, and Hunter and Aaron like my two best friends growing up and we were just in like the, the remember you used to have like a computer room in the house there used yeah, to be like yeah. a room with the, the so computer cool. when you had like dial up you know what I mean and uh, we definitely straight up just googled like massive boobies and like a bunch <laughs> of shit like that and then like not even an hour later like his dad went to go use the computer when he got home and just like goes to Google and just, you know how the search history pops, like auto f- yeah. pops up. Just, all right, <laughs> Which, we- what, what's up with this? <laughs> There's like big boobs, massive boobs, just all these Google image searches. Like it wasn't boobs, we even, boobs butts, weren't girls, even going to like boobs. a porn site. It was literally just Google image. Like. <laughs> I missed that. Yeah, the golden era. Maybe. I couldn't even imagine how funny it is to find a like, a six or seven year old's porn Google history. As a dad too, it's like it's all you, Fortnite. Are, it's on Fortnite. It's all Fortnite related. <laughs> that, that's how they have those. They have do. you seen this? What? If you type in Fortnite to Instagram and press search and go to accounts, it's all the top for pages. Besides the official Fortnite, they're account. all the like main character skins, but naked. I mean, dirty. That's, that's what we yeah. want. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What? I'm not gonna and say that's it. just Instagram. That's, like it's you on Instagram. Sur- yeah. You type in Fortnite to Instagram, yeah. and that, it's on there. Pretty aggressive. It's crazy. Okay, let's see here. If you had one completely useless superpower, what would it be? Like just for fun? Yeah. Mm. Well, I don't. Remote hand. 
Remote controller hand? Remote controller hand. Or I could just use universal remote. I have hand. a universal, universal remote. remote. <laughs> yeah, that's so good. And it turns into a remote too. It's like a fucking weird. Yeah, I just sit there yeah. and it turns into the exact remote we need. My pinky would be a phone charger, or any charger I need. Pinky is a phone. It's charger. It's pretty useful. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's actually way too. That's useful, too actually. strong of a power. Yeah. Dude. Oh, hold on. You need a charge? Just <laughs> et it up into. Yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking like a, like turn into like a car. That's also it's used very it's useful. Being a transformer. That's all, it's impossible to think of something that's useless. Well, not useless, I guess. I guess stupid. Just dumb. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah, you're like not a, you're like, not a superhero. You just got a beta power. Yeah. Like I just like my arms turn into like two wheels, wheels and I'm just like a Hot Wheel. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even fully turn into a car. Yeah. Uh, that's a good what, one. What do we got, Henry? I don't know. Maybe like just be able to hold my breath forever. <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be fun. <laughs> well, it's, that like, would... it's like useful, but like, what are you going to do in your life? <laughs> yeah, right? like it's you know not... what I'm saying? You're like at the beach, you're like, yo, watch this. He <laughs> just comes, he just comes I'm gonna back go in two hours. I'm going to go swim to Hawaii. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's pretty funny. useless, but kind of tight. A bank's getting robbed and you just... <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Nobody fucking breathe. <laughs> oh, I got this. <laughs> <laughs> One man survived. <laughs> Any tunnel you drive through with the fam? There you go. Yeah, you, you got, got it. Locked. That's good shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're so smart. <laughs> Let's see. Morgan, I saw something the other day that I thought of you for, because you've been repping the Kohl's Cash card for a little while now. Oh, yeah, the Kohl's Cash. So I was at the store the other day, and this guy, uh, you know how you can print whatever you want on your credit card? Mm-hmm. He had a Uno Reverse card. Printed on his credit card. That's dope. Really? And to hand it to the person and see them go, <laughs> you can't use that here. <laughs> That's and then realize good. the card would be, I think he would love that. I, yeah, like I think that. he would run That's with that. That's a you think for sure. That's fair. Because you could just film the reaction of every single person and every time there's no way they're not like, I'm not paying for this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be $37.95. Oh, really? <laughs> um, you guys have anything else? All right, I got a thinker. Just a nice discussion topic. If you could live forever, would you? Is there a way to die or no way to die? Um, it's impossible for you to die. So I'm Wolverine. Fuck yeah. Why not? Right. It's a pretty fun life, you know? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Am I, am I, I at, what age am I at? Um, so now. Yeah, just you get to stay at right <laughs> this exact second. You get to stay yeah. exact. Th- yeah, we're, we're, we're peaked out. <laughs> uh... Maybe. I thoroughly enjoy being alive. I think I would do Yeah, it. I mean, I think the, the only, the only like, <laughs> big rap, fan, the only like debate I've heard of this is just like, you wouldn't have any urgency to do anything important with your life. You wouldn't like be motivated to do fuck all. But you'd have forever to figure <laughs> but, something out. But you'd find something interesting to do. You'd want to find something interesting. Well, and you could also do that thing interesting for 30 years and then do something completely different. For exactly. like you could have like a million careers exactly. or whatever you want. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Like I'll go live in a fucking jungle for a whole lifetime and then come back. And the only thing I'm thinking negative about is I have to find like a whole group of friends like 10 times. <laughs> well, no, you all, you all times. live. Yeah. What if you, wait. Yeah. Are you the only one who lives forever? Does everyone live forever? That's yeah. If everyone lives forever. Yeah. Sign me up. Dude, my my uncle this. was 93. My uncle was 93 years old and he had no friends from his yeah. original days and he just had Friends back decades. Yeah, I was gonna say if you're the yeah, only he just one, had a, he had to move back to a bunch of sixty year olds. Moving back, bro. <laughs> you don't have to. I think I'd say if I was the only one to live forever, no, because yeah. you just watch everyone that you knew die, and then you just have to restart life. You have to restart every. Because like, think about you this. Need some let's kids. say, let's say right now you don't age anymore. Yeah, and then we get old. And it's like, do you hang out with us until we're sixty? <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, right. Like I'm still raging, and you guys are in a fucking yeah, nursing like, home. Yeah, <laughs> no, I feel like I'm do barely it. able to walk. If I, if you're the only one, I'd say no. Yeah, I'm saying no just because like I enjoy it now. But yeah, if everyone yeah. did, then obviously fuck yeah, let's run it up. Like I want to grow old. <laughs> well, how about this? If you were uh, if you're gonna live forever and you could live a different have a different career, what would be your next career that you would live life through again? I actually have that written down. I thought about this before. Yeah. <laughs> well, what are you picking then? Um, if I had to go different from what I answered with this last time. Hmm. Well, it could be the same. Well, I think that was same, like a yeah. confident yeah. answer. Well, I said like I'd give a shot at trying to be a comedian probably. Yeah, I'd probably go with like acting. But if I had to do something different. If I had to do something different or from I'd doing maybe, nothing. I'd just start golfing at like, you know, five years old. Ooh, that Ooh. would be tough not to pick. Yeah, it's lit. <laughs> if I just have... 
billion years to figure out how to putt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> at least it's a billion for you. You'd yeah, still suck ass. Well, considering I've been playing golf for four years now and I haven't gotten any better yet. Yeah. yeah. Then yeah. You need gonna, forever to yeah, figure that yeah, out. Yeah. At this rate, <laughs> yeah. forever. You're gonna need eternity. Yeah. That's up there for sure. But I think I'd still pick it. What about you, Henry? I don't know. I'd probably be like try to be like an elite athlete of some sort. Yeah, like I feel like you, an MMA fighter. Like what yeah. would my life like look like if I was just trying to be an mixed martial arts fighter that'd be wild or like a wall street tycoon hedge fund head fund crazy quadrillionaire guy. yeah just a ruthless what would that look like jordan belfort what vibes? else what else i don't know not not you're not going with surfing at all oh yeah yeah, the yeah. Pro surfer? <laughs> yeah i thought you life as a pro surfer would be sick yeah for sure i couldn't think of a cooler life i've always wanted to be a surfer i can't do it though it's and that would be hard. something that would again take me an infinite amount. It's of life so much harder than people understand. Hard. Remember like, when we tried to surf? We almost died. Yeah, we went to so we went to Hawaii and we did like the classic. They take you to the easy beach. Yeah, yeah. and like push you and start you, and we're up, you know, doing it, and we're hyped and we're like, oh, we got this. So we go back to the surf shop where we rented the boards and we're like, where's the where's the real waves at? Send us over, <laughs> and he sends us over to. The, he's like, "Oh, okay, oh. if you want to do it, <laughs> this so will be fun to watch." <laughs> yeah, so he sent us over to like the locals' beach, and we're literally probably takes us an hour to get out past the break. Oh, ten. That's foot. like the hardest part. Literally, yeah. Get no, take, out. And yeah. there's there's literally like a group of locals just sitting over there laughing at us because not ten only not waves, only bro. for the reason that it's taking us forever to get out, we're also trying to get out where there's a giant reef, like so sketch. And on the way back in, we're like, we finally get out past everything. We're like, fuck, we got to get back in. Morg, his board pops up, hits him in the head. He's got a knot. <laughs> but, like, he's Dude, got an absolute like, knot. If it would have hit me any harder, I could have just was knocked this? out. Oh, uh-huh. uh, I think we're in Kauai. Kauai. Yeah. Ooh. Or was it gnarly? I forget. My Either yeah, one of the islands, the big one. Kauai, <laughs> Kauai, Oahu. But, uh, and then me on the way in, the entire bottom side of my board just scrapes the whole reef and just rips it to shreds. Yo. And then so we get back in and we're like, well, Nobody we, was like supervising you? That's what we were thinking. Like the locals <laughs> yeah. are just over there it's laughing like, at no us. No leashes, bro. <laughs> <laughs> They're laughing at us, not Sucks. telling us, you're going to die. Yeah. Dude, there's yeah. a lot of ways to die out there yeah. for sure. I, I fucking am so Actually, surfing has the least amount of injuries out of any sport. Because I guess the least like, amount. The impact is less, super low. Less than like pickleball. Any basketball, football, soccer, all, all that like shit. Virtually no impact. Way Most yes, yeah. though. Yeah. What? Most no. deaths, though. No. Most shark no. attacks, for sure, Oh, though. most deaths? I don't yeah, it's got to be. No. Uh, well, because if it's any more than, like, a dozen. How many people die playing football and shit? It's like, a, like the well, like it's a like, Easter it's people. It's like later on, you know what I mean? Like no, the it's dam- just like a heart The damage condition. happens later on. It's what like a heart condition. Like well, no, it's like you're, you're, you have CTE. Yeah, but yeah, that's yeah. not, you're not dying or, playing the sport, though. But I'm saying it's caused by it. Yeah, I know yeah. a lot of people that have been attacked by sharks, but... Really? You know a lot. Oh, I have like five fr- good friends that have been... See, that's why I don't fuck with I've the ocean. Well. It's like they're very survivable. Like we're not like in like South Africa or Australia or anything. Like yeah. great whites, so, yeah. But, but like... I just, I don't fuck with I have the my ocean. friends that just have like fucking... Chunk shark bites their on their like, calves. One of my friend got his arm mangled by a bull shark. He was on like Shark oh Shark my, Week and shit. Really? Yeah. Holy it's shit. gnarly. Jesus. Yeah, dude. The ocean. It's just basically everything in there is designed to fucking kill you. <laughs> <laughs> this is like this is like the, when anyone asks me, "Would you rather be in a fight with a shark or a tiger?" It's like, give me the tiger a million times. No million. way. Bro. Here's the reason though. Here's my reason though. At least I'm on land where I'm quick. But like, but tiger's I'm, quicker. But here's it the thing: it's quicker. But it, in water, I'm. If the tiger's gonna go after you, it's trying to kill you. Sharks aren't trying to kill you. They're just mistaking you for. It also else, you know? sharks don't have paws that will fucking claw yeah, you. Yeah, you just punch them in the eye and they're gone. So you get a knife. Oh, okay, give me a knife. I'm still dying from the tiger. But I'm just so no, scared you can, you can of not being it. able to see. That's the, the thing, thing that's fucking at coming least at me. Let me see yeah. it just mangle me. To death. A tiger will fuck if you up. If you're saying like one v one, like <laughs> I'm ready for it, I think I'm going shark. But I'm like a shark's just gonna come up out of nowhere. Here's the thing with the water though, right? So like. A tiger's running at you. You could like dive to the side. That's not good. Dude, like, yeah, agile like in the water. Do you know how agile tigers are? Oh, I'm, I'm saying I at least have a, some athleticism in the water. That's... I could see the shark coming at me. Like I could see a million feet deep, and I could see the shark, and I'm still. Oh, you can't see a million. In feet what deep. universe can you see I'm a million? Feet if I could. Oh, if you could. If I could, well, you I, can't just. I can't move. Dude, that happened to me and my friend before. We were sitting in this super sharky spot in uh, Florida. And the sharks are like not huge there, they're not like great whites, but one just was charging at me and my friend. And he just had us, we like put our hand in the water and splash it and it turned away. And we we're like, 
But the fin was out in the water. Was like, oh my god! I, come, oh, I would fully. Terrifying. But they're like, shit. they're like little. They're like five feet. You know, they're what, not what, like what's 10. like the most common shark in like Florida? Black tip. Oh, black tip reef sharks. Black tip. Fuck that. The one bro. that fucked my friend up though was a bull shark. Yeah, those are the gnarly boys, right? Yeah, they're like the most really, his arm, bro. If you saw saw pictures of his arm, you'd be like. Dude, fuck how does that. he still have it? You got stingrays, yeah. jellyfish, sharks. I'm not going in the fucking ocean. Yeah. No. Jellyfish suck. I've been. I got like a man of war yeah. wrapped around me before. Oh god! And your whole body gets like paralyzed. And my left leg was just like paralyzed. Dude, I was like, I can't shit. drive home, bro. Can you drive home, dude? That is. <laughs> is just, it painful or is it? Oh, just paralytic? it's so fucking painful. Man of war, dude. Not that's like the, the big daddies, right? That's the big daddy. Yeah, fuck yeah. that. You're not going to die, but Those are the ones that look like floating trash bags, right? Yeah, they're like purple. They're yeah. like purple bags. And they're super like long. Dude, the, like those. people ask like, what, oh, what would an alien look like? Like that, the whole ocean is full of aliens. Yeah. Like what, <laughs> That is a fucking alien. Like it doesn't have any structure or like brain or anything. It's just this floating thing. Death thing. Yeah, yeah. floating fucking <laughs> stingy fucker. All right, I get that. it why people wouldn't want to be uh, yeah. surfing. Yeah. I don't like the ocean. Understandable. I'm a big pool guy. Yeah, <laughs> huge. Like if I'm, I'm like at like a resort and it's on the beach, catch me in the pool for real. I'll go lay on the sand, <laughs> the tub, the kiddie pool. I'll go pool. lay on the sand, but I'm going in the pool. The short end. When it comes to cooling off, not going in the ocean. Yeah. And even besides the creatures, you can die from a fucking wave. True. <laughs> you could for you can sure. Get held yeah. under by a you wave. You could get taken out by the wind. So if a wave All would right, definitely yeah. fuck you up. Now you're just being. <laughs> <dead>. <laughs> I was being vulnerable, and you kind of exposed it. You know, you doubled right. down on me. You want to um, cap us off, Daddy? Yeah, Henry, you got anything uh, you want to plug on the show or anything Listen while we got Listen to my you? shit. Huh? Listen to my shit. Listen dude. to Henry no, Fong. You're just at Henry Fong on everything, correct? Uh, Soon to be hooked on Fong. Like DJ. <laughs> DJ Henry Fong, right? Yeah, I think it's DJ Henry Fong on Instagram. Okay, beautiful. The guy that took at Henry Fong, he wouldn't give it to me. I offered him $500. He's yeah. in China and he would said no. Really? Yeah. It's like bro, I'll Venmo you. Well, we have, yeah, the guy who has FOMO on Twitter has been inactive since 2012. Whack. And like, I'm like, can we like message Twitter and tell them to fucking deactivate his account? Please. No. But so what are, what are we at? What, we're at at FOMO Music underscore. At FOMO Music underscore. Um, other than that, Henry, thank you so much for uh, rocking out with the boys today. Sunday fun day. Yeah. A little Sunday fun day, couple ales, couple uh, couple combos. <laughs> hey, Jesus, cut it. <laughs> cut it. Oh, uh, maybe one too many ales. <laughs> All right, ladies and gents. You guys cleaned up, man. Yeah, yeah. we definitely episode powered eight in the books. Episode eight in the books. Thanks we for will, listening. Uh, Smash the fucking like and subscribe. We absolutely. appreciate the shit out of all that. We will catch you on the flip flop.